Hey beautiful people, I'm Eric Lee and you're watching 31 Accountant. Uh, today's video I'm just going to be talking about updates on pretty much self care and give you an update of how I'm doing right now. Uh, one and a half, almost two weeks into this prep. Uh, and just kind of break it down for you guys. But first, I'm going to make myself a protein shake. Hey guys, so I'm back. I'm back with another product to review. This one is all about pretty much self-care. Uh, the last few weeks I've been really, you know, dyed in and really, you know, dialing in. I got a new coach, Chris Jones. If you've seen the last video, you already know. Uh, anybody interested in my progress or my macros? Uh, so far I've lost five pounds. Uh, my macros are 70 grams of fat, 250 grams of carb and 240 protein for anybody who wants to know uh, and yes the protein's quite high but for my size it's, it's actually uh, pretty spot on but getting to the product we're going to be doing a review on yes it's one of those guns one of these guns that uh massage guns that take care of you uh, this one is just you know it's supposed to be a pro professional deep massage gun it has four different heads on it and truthfully i think you only need maybe two of these but i got this a very good deal and i couldn't pass up on it this is how it comes this is the main body right there the battery uh one two three and four heads right there and a charging cable right there so uh I've had this and I've been using this for about three weeks now. I can tell you, uh, before all I was using was a, uh, a roller, just a regular roller. Uh, and it got the job done, but it was work. I didn't feel like doing it. Couldn't reach certain places. This gun has alleviated a lot of that. Uh, it's pretty simple. Uh, for most part, all you need is three main pieces. You need uh, the head attachment, the main battery, I mean the main body and the battery. Goes together fairly easy. You have the push side, you just slide it all the way up till you can't slide it in no more. Then you connect the head, just push it in. There's no weird thing about it, no lining anything up. You see at the bottom there's an on and off switch, you just slide it on to the on switch lights up in the back shows your battery power press this button and it's on you press it again and the speed goes up and the more vibrations you press it one more time and you get your max amount i don't know if you guys are picking up the sound of this it's mildly annoying but it's not the loudest one and truthfully it's it's not that loud uh unless you're in bed already and your spouse is next to you in their sleep I don't think this is gonna annoy anybody uh, there's a few flaws to this it's big I, and I know I'm a big guy I got big hands but for the average person look the grip around here can be kind of I don't know it'd be kind of loose because you have something that's vibrating in your hand but at the same time, you may not be able to wrap your hand completely around it. So sometimes, depending on the angles, I've seen people do it like this because their hands are getting tired from the vibrations. Uh, another down is the make of this. Although it's heavy and the parts work, they just always feel like they're gonna break. You can see the seam, the seam line in between this. This is not carbon fiber, this is plastic. Heavy. Big dogs kind of, I guess the uh, key is almost here. You can feel the plastic and it's, it's one of those things where you know if you drop this, it's not coming back, it's broken. As you can see, you're not gonna get a replacement likely because it's, none of the instructions are in English. Well, yeah, there's nothing on here that's in English at all except for the name. Uh, it holds a charge for a while. And it doesn't take very long to charge. I've only had to charge this thing twice. I normally 
use it for four minutes, three, four minutes at a time. Uh, the other head that it comes with, this one's a rounded head. It's real good for just everywhere. This fork-like one is for your spine. There's one that's fairly narrow, this one. And it's like, uh, maybe in like joints like this or in your knees, just places that are more stationary pain. You know, get one direct spot. Then you have your flathead. I've yet to use this one yet, but I'm pretty sure it's for like, I don't know, your size, your abs, somewhere where there's not much muscle over it. I could be wrong though. If you know better, you know better. I, I haven't used that yet. But I say other than the build quality, it's been reliable. I think I spent uh, on Amazon like a hundred and twenty some dollars. I spent like a hundred and twenty some dollars on this uh, on this machine, and I've got my money's worth. It's a great product to me, and I'm putting a link down below for you guys. Uh, what's something else? Oh, another downside. Not really a big problem for me because when I use this, uh, I normally use it at the house. You know, when I'm laying in bed or after I'm done working out. But if you plan on traveling, this does not come with a travel case. I kept this box because this is the only secure place to put it. And like I said, once you drop this, it's pretty much a guarantee that it's not gonna work again. But I would recommend this. I would give it eight thumbs up because it's affordable. It gets the job done. And unless you're traveling a lot with it, I think it should last you as long as you don't drop it like an iPhone. Well, that's pretty much my quick review on that. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm Eric Lee. You're watching 31 and Counting. Leave a comment, subscribe. Let me know what other things you want me to review. And, uh, you know, if I don't know, I can't review it. We out.